because you would have seen her just go down in there. The structure that this uh, Mason Bee House is attached to is sitting on concrete blocks and this particular one is a space down beside it. She goes down between the block and the earth and gets earth to come back and build her seal with as she goes back again. I'll show you what she's doing over at the uh, Mason Bee House but it's only about I don't know, seven or eight feet from here. She doesn't go very far to get her clay. She came up out of there a few minutes ago with a piece that was so big she couldn't lift off with it. She had to drop it and go get another one. We may be lucky enough to see the wasp or hornets working here too. That's her back with some more earth to put in the place where she laid the egg this morning. I have, if you go to my blog, uh, go to the uh, channel page here and off to the right there's a link to my blog. I put some uh, close-up photographs that I did with my camera. Much better than the ones that I'm able to do with this. There's one of the hornets. Somebody left a comment for me this morning and said there are solitary hornets as well and that's probably what these are. I think there are at least two of those along with the mason bee. And the hornet tried to get in the hole where the mason bee was working and she came back at the same time and she just sort of shooed it away. There didn't seem to be any big fight or anything. I think he just sort of said, oh yeah, that's not my hole, is it? That's yours. <laughs> anyway, it didn't seem to be a big issue with her. Uh, there's a tiny little hornet. I haven't seen that one before going into a, one of the holes. So these nests are being used by at least two different kinds of hornets and the, and the mason bee. Don't hear her coming back, but she'll be back any second. She just goes a few feet away here. The last time she came back, she brought back a little piece of grass and took that in there. So that must have something to do with building the plug between the larvae too. She must put grass into the into the seal. I'm spending my days now watching this thing. I'm fascinated by it. <laughs> she is. Yeah, this time she's got a piece of grass too. She's quite a big bee when you get her slowed down there so you can get a look at her. Hard, having a hard job getting that piece of grass in where she wants it. I think she's got that tube pretty well full, but there's probably room for, I suppose, at least one more layer. She's certainly not sealing it from the outside. She's putting a seal behind the last egg that she laid. showing on this little, oops, she just dropped her piece of grass or moss or whatever it was that she was trying to get in there. Probably positioning her mouth full of clay or earth, whatever she's using. There she goes. I won't continue to <laughs> record every movement that she makes, but I just thought you might like to know that uh, there is, doesn't seem to be any problem with the hornets, and she is progressing here. And if you look at the blog, there's a photograph of her when she was backed in there this morning laying her egg. <laughs> 